It's not something you hear about every day when it comes to local television news. An elephant as a station mascot. Yet Channel 2 has the unique distinction of not only having one, but our Susie Q actually lived here on station grounds. Why an elephant? Well, why not? Channel 2 already had dogs, cats, exotic birds, a donkey, alligator, and even a kangaroo. And the station's owner, Drayton Hasty, simply thought it was a good idea to buy an elephant. And so in 1954, he bought one, an Asian elephant for $2,700 from a New York importer. In 2008, the town of Mount Pleasant honored Susie Q with an historical marker in our front yard. Our beloved Susie Q provided years of enjoyment for people in the low country. Parents brought their children to the station to visit Susie Q and ride her back. She was even the target of a major prank at the Citadel in the fall of 1958. Now a part of the Citadel's history, thanks to Bobby Schwartz and Jim Jeffrey, both from the Citadel class of 1959. We went out on Thursday night and proceeded to go to the pen, which was right out in front of the station. And the pen was unlocked, I recall that, and I, I thought that found that to be very unusual. Once we hooked the trailer behind the car, the car was sitting at a kind of angle like this once we loaded the Susie Q, and I knew we would drive across the Grace Memorial Bridge with the car at this angle with an elephant in the back. I think it accomplished what we wanted it to accomplish. Everybody was excited, and uh, make a long story short, we beat VMI. Young and the young at heart, Susie Q brought smiles and joy to people across the low country. And like an elephant's memory, her legacy is long and everlasting. Octavia Mitchell, Count On Two.